Hi, I'm Tyson, and you are watching JavaScript Vignettes. And today I'm going to show you how to take an array and uh, search on it um, so that you can get um, just a subset of that array. Um, so we're going to start out with just making an array. So we're going to say uh, const uh, my array equals, and we'll just make up something. So this will be an array of objects, and every object will contain um, let's see a different kind of uh, utensil in your kitchen. So uh, this one will be have the name of knife. This will have a name of fork. And this will have a name of spork. So now that we have this array, we can uh, we can look at it and make sure that it's everything we need it to be. And uh, there we have it. So let's say that we want to just um, get things that end in an ORK. So that would filter out the knife, but we would still have um, the fork and the spork. The way we would do that is with the array filter method. So what we would do is we would say my array dot filter, and then um, what it's going to do is every time it goes, it loops over that array, it's going to give you um, the the element that it's looping over. So first it would be the object with the name of knife and so on. So we'll take the first one um, and we will get the name out of it. And then we'll say uh, name compares to Uh, actually, we don't want to do compare, so we want to do um, index of. Ork, um, not equal to negative zero. So what index of does in JavaScript is it returns the index that the um, thing you're searching for shows up in the uh, in the string, and so um, we know that if it's negative one, then it's going to actually not have found it. So, um, so if it's not equal to negative one, we know that it has found it. So when we run that, we get the the ORK the ORK thing, so the fork and the spork. However, let's say that we wanted to um, make this case insensitive. So right now, if we did like uppercase ORK, we get back an empty array, and that's not what we would want. So what we would do for that is we would just uh, to lowercase or to uppercase them. So we do to lowercase dot index of, and then we would also take the uh, string that we're that we're trying to search for and uh, say to lowercase on that. So there we go. We're back having a spork and a fork. Um, and so that's uh, how you can filter things um, using using JavaScript. Um, and so uh, in the next episode, we'll look at um, some more cool array things. Hope you've enjoyed it.